I'm Joseph Halpert, the Editor-in-Chief of the American Journal of Medicine, and I'm here today again to call your attention to what, what I think is a very interesting article in this month's uh, journal. Um, it's from the United Kingdom. First author is Prokopidis, um, and uh, it, it has to do with the amount of fiber that one uh, has in the diet and its relationship with cognitive dysfunction. Um, so uh, using a very large English database um, that included dietary uh, information from, from the uh, individuals in the database uh, and also included some uh, diagnostic information about cognitive function, uh, they were able to accumulate quite a large number of individuals and looked at the relationship between how much fiber was in the diet and the development of cognitive dysfunction. And actually, for me, no surprise, the more fiber in the diet means that's a more vegetarian diet. And those individuals who have the more vegetarian diet with high fiber actually had a decrease in the incidence of cognitive dysfunction, of the development of dementia. And for me, it, the probable explanation is these people had less atherosclerosis and therefore less atherosclerotic uh, vascular damage to the brain and therefore um, had less uh, in a cases of dementia and uh, cognitive dysfunction. So again, some support for the idea that there ought to be lots of fruits and vegetables in our diet, um, not just meat and potatoes. In any case, thanks very much for reading the American Journal of Medicine. I hope you'll enjoy this interesting article. Um, and I look forward to talking with you next month. Thanks for staying in touch uh, through our website and our Facebook and our other social media.